What do you actually do, Don? I mean, you sit here every day just hanging about. And stop copying me, mate. It's freaky. It really is. You're a strange, strange person, Don. Okay. Right. Um, well, good talking with you, I guess. McLafferty's been riding asses again. Better lay low. Yep, will do. But for now, I just, just have to nip to the toilet. Drank too much coffee. You know how it goes. I heard a noise. What, what happened? Is everyone okay? Alice? Alice? Uh... Do you need a hand? yippee There'll be nowhere... And we're back. Right. We're here at the Crimson Caravan and there's been a terrible accident. There's been some sort of explosion and... Poor Alice here has been... Killed. It's terrible. <laughs> right. So. One down. One to go. Hey, Cass. How are you doing? Let's hit the road. <laughs> oh, yeah. And that's it. For the Crimson Caravan. Well. Now. On to settle accounts with Gloria Van Graaff. Putting her down would suit me just fine. Might be a little tougher than the Crimson Caravan. Yeah. Van Graaffs are like a nest of rattlers. And the guns they've got are brotherhood caliber. Right. So... Ooh, got it. Let's loot the place. Oh! She's got a... Ooh, yes. They've got a lot of stuff. Oh, I never thought of that. That that's Oh, good point. You sure you want to do the cushions? Got it. Let's loot Music the place. Music to my ears. Well, it actually reminds me. Let some. Um... Yeah. Maybe you wanted to, to see. Okay, they've cleaned her up. There was a bit of her over there, and there's another bit of her. And um. Don seems completely broken up over this. Obviously. All right, Crimson Caravan safe key. All right. Um, everything's still classified as stealing, is it? Is it, is it? Are you going to get, like, really annoyed if I open this? You are, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. I'll go that way. Holding my breath. Whiskey! Three shooter? What the hell? Okay. You really don't notice much, do you? Strange person. What the hell was that? Weapon. Three shooter. It is a 12 gauge. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Um. Yeah. <laughs> I'm liking that. Oh, gas, look at this. Look at this. Uh, a three shooter. Don't have any rounds for it. What is it classifying as? Let's have a quick. Base damage 80 rounds per second, so it shoots quite a few of them at once, obviously. Um, it's actually very good damage. It's better damage than my lever action shotgun. Oh, you know what? I mean... <laughs> just a style alone... All right, we're going to get some rounds for this thing. Okay, so. Can I? Hey there. You Do I have anything to, to sell? Buy or sell? Mostly sell, but. 
Can do. Just have a look at what you've got, first of all. Okay, now he had a mod for the lever action shotgun. Giving me more ammo capacity. Now, I mean, to be honest, I am seriously thinking of changing to the three shooter. But, I don't know. <laughs> this has now got more ammo. And I do like this. It's a good look. It is a good look, mind you. Um, what? Uh, there seems to be something horribly wrong with this model. In th Okay, we're sticking with the lever action for now until I figure out what I have just done wrong with that. Alright, let's go pick Veronica up and go and speak to the Van Graffs. We gotta get in with them. We gotta do some. Uh, I want you to Aww, follow. When the standing around was getting excited. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. We gotta go and talk to the Van Graffs and win their confidence. I guess. You know. It does occur to me that I probably shouldn't be wandering in there with Cass or Veronica. Actually, I, I'm not sure Veronica's really the the let's go and massacre everyone type of person. So, probably, probably best if I... You! You, 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 you! Reach for the sky, mister. Um, give me the gun. Sorry, but I need to shoot Stacy. We can find you another gun. Um, I'll swap it with you for a forty-four pistol. Much better to shoot Stacy with, kind of. Um, can I buy that gun from you then? This is the best gun in the whole galaxy. I paid a million caps for it, and it wasn't even brand new. You are a terrible liar. Oh, but I am better. <laughs> yeah, but your heavy use has really depreciated its value. It's only worth 20 caps now. Oh, man. Awesome. It's Stacy's fault. She pretends like she didn't get hit. That's it's still because you're a, a lousy shot. I guess I'll take it. <laughs> you look tired. Maybe you should... I don't care. See you later, alligator. Yeah, yeah. Very good. Guys, with <laughs> oh. wow, good thing the safety was on. Uh, look, we got this whole Flash Gordon vibe going now. Oh, we have got to go and find something to blow up. Now we can only use this outside, so we can't use it on the Van Graffs. Oh, can we go find something else to shoot first, please? Wanna go and there's gotta be something around here we can try this out on. Um Come on. We have got what other quests have we got? Legends that don't care, heart type, but yes, we know the one. I need to find a man named Carlos, apparently somewhere in North Vegas. Let's find Carlos. We can rebuild him. Where is North Vegas? Up there, okay. Edie my love, we're gonna go get him again. Slim at Gamora, right. Debt collector, probably don't want to hit them with this weapon. Don't fence me in. Vegas, kill Eileen and retrieve her finger. Will there be a finger left after I hit with it? God, have I got absolutely nothing that I can do with those are inside? Kill Nephi and acquire his head, preferably intact. Again, probably not the best weapon to use on him then. Ah, uh, restoring hope, no. I don't have a single solitary thing that requires people to be horribly blown up. <sighs> what have we been doing, guys? What have we been doing? Is that this? Do you think we just get to... Can we just get a fiend? Uh-oh. To... What did I just say? I wanted to test my new weapon out. <sighs> Damn it. Probably a bad idea to test this out here, but still. Okay, who's that? I've got to go and 
get money from some people. I should keep my eyes out for them. And there was one that was a ghoul I was supposed to be. Hey. It was you! Hey, man. Can you spare a few caps? Nope. I'm collecting, yeah, collecting money to pay back the Garrets. Oh, yeah. I guess the Garrets sent you after me. Yep. Look, I've got the caps right here. Just don't hurt me. Ah, uh, that's fine. Speech, you... Ch no, no, that's fine. That'll do if he's... I won't. Thanks for not killing me. Yeah, you're welcome. See, that was relatively easy, wasn't it? Oh, I want to go and shoot someone with this big space weapon thingy. Damn it. I can't think of anyone nearby that I can go shoot. All I can think of is fiends in fiend territory. What do you think, guys? There's this... I mean... Where was it? Over here, Bolt 3 area. We've got loads of bounties in this area. We could wander off and kill lots of fiends with the super weapon and then pick up the bounties. Mind you, for Driver Nephi, we're supposed to talk to the people at McCarran Base first and uh, the, the rangers, I think. You and the rat again? Really? I am completely torn on this. I want to shoot some people with this. Can we, I don't know, hold off on the whole vengeance thing just for a quick, you know, side mission? I mean, look at it, cast. Look at it. We've got to test it out. It's a bit rusty, actually, isn't it? It is a bit rusty. We need to check it's working. We do. Let's go check it's working. <laughs> oh. Okay. The only thing is, is how the hell do I get to Bolt 3? Okay. I brought the truck here to Camp McCarran and I thought I'd make some rounds for the three shooter. <laughs> oh, who doesn't love that? I mean, seriously, I know oh. someone is now going, I don't love it, but <laughs> yeah, that's brilliant. That is awesome. That may be my favorite weapon for a long time, except for the rangefinder, of course, the Flash Gordon thing. Right, so I've got plenty of rounds for that, and we've got to find... Right, we, got, we have got some quests, so we may as well do them in that area while we're testing out our new weapon. And the first one was... Three Card Bounty, it was called, wasn't it? Yes. Oh, that's New Vegas Bounties. Kill Eileen. Now, Eileen was in the neighborhood over here, so we might pick her up at the same time. Um, and um, then go back. You know what? I've got to go to Prim and pick Eddie up anyway, so I've got to go to New Vegas Bounties. It all works out. Cass has got a fill of vengeance. She's killed one person today. She can wait till tomorrow for the, you know. Yes, she can. Right, so we're going to go here. We've got to go through the Fiend territory. And we're looking for Driver Nephi. But it's optional. Enlist the help of Lieutenant Gorobitz, I guess, because it's American. And his first recon snipers to take down Driver Nephi. Right. We're looking for people with red berets, I believe. Hello. Sergeant Bitterroot? No. Corporal Betts? Guys? I'm Bitterroot, first recon. You got a reason to talk to me? Yeah, I want to talk to your... Uh, Bitterroot, you have an unusual name. How long have you been? Not too friendly, are you? Guess not. I don't mean nothing by it. You okay. really want to talk to somebody, try ten of spades. He's always got plenty to say. All right. Me? I'm here to do my job. For now, that job is shooting fiends. Okay. Um, respect. Out of curiosity, though, why are you called Bitterroot? You trying to start trouble? No. Or do you really not know where I got that name? How would I know? We just met. We met ten minutes ago. Uh, ten seconds ago. Uh, speech. T you know what? Now I'm curious. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Goodbye. Bye. Stay right there. I have a suit that you're going to absolutely love. <laughs> Dark business. Uh, five. No, that's five. What else have I got? Have I got anything else? Flashlight. Headband. Why? Okay, yeah, no. Sorry. Um, trader's hat. Plus five barter. Not what I need. And I've got... Of course, I could take the book. There's a book somewhere. Magazine. Uh, meeting people plus three. Or... Out of curiosity, let's... How, how far am I off? Stats. Speech, 27. I need two extra charisma points, don't I? The thing is... Where has it gone? Whiskey! Two charisma! <laughs> I can stop any time I want. No, I can't. Well, yes, I can. I just don't want to. Um, sorry, what was I looking at? Stats. Speech, 31. I'm... Um, Hi, I didn't think you'd be back. What's I'm this about? Drunken in a suit. Do you like me now? <laughs> you trying to start trouble? Um, you really not know where I got that name. Yeah. That's terrible, isn't it? I didn't mean to offend, but you have to tell me. You don't have to tell me if you'd rather not. It's a con name. You know, the great cons. Okay. That's what my parents were. I figured I grew up around the bastards. They owed me a name after all they put me through. Um, what happened to your parents? They're dead. Got themselves killed at Bitter Springs. Served them right, if you ask me. That's a little brutal, isn't it? Um, what happened? It was a massacre. That's what a lot of NCR folk will tell you. Most of them feel plenty bad about what happened. But I was there. Saw it myself. I don't care what anybody says. The cons asked for Bitter Springs. They wouldn't leave the NCRB. My damn parents, too. They were just as bad as the rest. Okay. You don't really mean that, do you? So, the name, it comes from Bitter Springs. Okay. How did you survive the massacre? Guess I could tell a pretty good story if I had a mind. But the truth is, I don't know. Just got lucky. They brought me to Daughtry after the battle. He was just a captain back then. Guess he saw something in me. Knew I didn't belong with the cons. Maybe okay, right, too. yes. It's the guy that gave me the About how his men killed my folks. I told him he did me a service, but he didn't believe me. Still doesn't. He's All a right. good man, Daughtry. Doesn't act like it sometimes, I know. But he didn't have to take me in. Okay, Intelligence 7, you're not telling me something. God, I'm smart. You couldn't have forgotten the whole massacre. It's like I tell Major Daughtry. Best not to look under a rock if you don't really want to know what's there. I want to know Could what's there. Could be that NCR found some blood on me and none of it mine. Could be that a few of those cons didn't die from NCR bullets. Oh, I had scores right. of my own to settle. Deeper ones than NCR ever had. Don't bother asking who they were with. Um, you know what? Um, um I think we've gone yeah, deep enough. Yeah, that's probably best. Yeah. How long have you been with First Recon and where's your commanding officer? Oh. While, I guess. No, I don't want you commanding officer. I don't keep too careful track of time. Your father. I like to keep things simple. Just focus on now. That's why they made me a sniper. You let your mind wander back a ways and you lose sight of what's in front of your eyes. Good way to miss a mark. Okay. Uh, uh, you know what? All right. I think we've exhausted this conversation. <clears throat> um, Corporal Betsy. Never seen you around before. What do you want? Um, have you seen any serious... How about a date? No, thank you. You're a sniper. What gave me away? The big gun? The shades? Or the attitude? Yeah, yeah, very funny. The big gun. Um, I didn't know all snipers wear shades. See, that's why I wear shades. That's why I wear shades. Actually, I didn't notice, notice the attitude until now. Actually, I didn't. That's true. <laughs> You're not as dumb as I thought you'd be. We got the same sense of humor. Probably better to no, walk honestly. away while I still like you, though. All kinds of things piss me off. Like just about anything that anybody says. Would you marry me? Okay. Um, you know what? She's not going to like that. Um, have you seen any serious combat here that don't look like this? Not unless you count the fiends as serious. Gorobetz keeps us inside the fence most of the time. Doesn't matter to me. I just shoot bad guys. Okay. Sooner or later, they'll move us out to the dam, though. That's when the shit gets nasty. Uh, Betsy... I don't want to alarm you, but I think the guy behind you may have just died. 
Probably should check on him. So what? Uh, sorry, I wasn't actually listening. What? Do you, explain, please explain. Legion fights to win, and they're smart. Hell of a lot smarter than these crazy fiends. But I don't feel bad about shooting Legion boys. Me neither. Fiends, on the other hand, sometimes I get pangs of conscience. Not often, but sometimes. No, that that that's the first thing you've said that doesn't make much sense to me. Sorry. First time I heard about a conscience in a while. Yeah. I've killed so many people I don't even think about it. That sounds bragging. Let's not do that. Some cute little junkie bitch, so fucked up she doesn't even know that she's the bad guy. And I've got a headshot her. Makes me think. Might just be sex, though. I see some cute little number, and I'd rather get in her pants. So maybe I'm a stone-cold bitch after all. Okay. Um, how about a day? She just literally told you that you're not her type. Uh, Bye-bye. Yeah. Try not to get killed. It's on the top of my list of things to do. Oh no, there's a firing break, the firing range. Okay. Um She was cool. I wish I could bring her with us. Where's Ver where's Veronica? We've lost Ver really? How have we how have we lost Veronica? How have we lost Ver we did, we picked her up. I we definitely picked her up. I picked her up. I picked her up. She's near the ends. Where is she? Near the gun runners? And that's what we see. I knew we'd picked her up because she wouldn't be near the gun runners otherwise. <sighs> we'll pick her up later. Hey, my man. Ten of spades. First recon sharpshooter at your s service. Why are you wearing a scarf around your mouth? You horribly disfigured. Uh, ten of spades. Yeah, where did you get that name? The LT. Goral Betts gave it to me. That's the man I want to see. see. I wanted to be ace of spades. But the LT says, sorry, kid, you're t t t too green. So he calls me 10 instead. Okay. It's okay, though. I get a few more k k k kills under my belt. He'll move me up to Jack. Jack of spades. Sounds better, right? That sounds much better. It. Eventually, I'll make it to ace. Think no, I'll no, no. Stop though. at Jack. Nothing's better than Jack. Jack is where it's at. Seriously. How long have you been a sharpshooter? What do you do? You know what? Are you alright? Why am I asking him that? Oh yeah, f f fine. Just a little st st stutter. Had it since I was a kid. Doesn't stop me from kicking ass. Good lad. I'm sure it does, I'm not taking the mickey out of him. Damn right. You know what? Yeah. Don't I'll tell us personally, but we're done around. with the conversation. But good lad, keep shooting people. Uh, yeah. Lieutenant Gorbin. No, you. Don't talk to you. Oh, he's still alive. No, sorry. Yes, glad to see you're still alive. Sergeant Bitterroot. No, we've spoken to Sergeant Bitterroot. Really? Doctor's bags. I don't suppose you'll sell them or leave so I can acquire them. <sighs> Looking for a lieutenant. Lieutenant! Lieutenant, sorry. I'm gonna get told off for my awful English. <laughs> oh dear. Yes. I suppose technically that's not even English, is it? I believe it's from the French pronunciation. Well, no idea, to be honest. But that is... Ha You've got a red beret. Please be the man I'm looking for. No, you're ten of Uji. What's it? Okay. Does he have a way marker? Because, honestly, he's annoying me now. There. That way? Really? Um. No, that's... Now, you're Major Datrit. Don't want to speak to you. I want to speak to... What's his name? Yeah, Lieutenant Gorobitz and his first recon sniper. Says, <laughs> Paging Lieutenant Go... Hello. Hello! I'm Lieutenant Gorobitz, first recon. 
If you're looking to collect a bounty, you should talk to Major Daughtry. Um, you no, know, got it, yes. Major Daughtry said I should talk to you about taking down Driver Nephi. Whatever you need, we'll make sure it gets done. Oh, I need you to help me take down- are you having problems with your hearing? What can you tell me about him? Not enough. We've been trying to put a bullet in him for a few weeks. He's strong as a Brahmin bull, and he's fast. Seems like he usually runs with a gang of fiends, uses them for cover. We haven't been able to get a clean shot at him. Okay. Betsy swears she's hit him. Twice. But if she's right, it didn't seem to slow him down. How good is your squad? I've been sniping since I was old enough to walk. A lot of us sharpshooters get recruited off the farms and ranches out west. Comes natural to us. As for my squad, they're the best we have. My word on that. They're all hand-picked, and I won't work with anybody who isn't up to snuff. Ten of Spades is the greenest of the bunch, but he's a farm boy, like me. Shooting's in his blood. Okay, I'm going to need your help. You've got it. I probably don't, What but... did you have in mind? You thinking of luring him into range of my snipers? Um, come... Yeah, well, it's up to you. What do you want? I'd rather just bring your people with me. No, no. Do you think that will work? Can we hit him? Damn straight we can. Question is whether he kills you before we get a clear shot. Um, it's one hell of a risk you'd be taking. But if you're willing, we'll do everything we can to keep you alive. Um, yeah, sure. Definitely. <laughs> Listen, my team has a debt to settle with Nefi. We've seen too many of our boys get brained by that golf club of his. Golf club. You lure him out for us, and if we can score some payback, we'll all pitch in caps for a reward. I like My team will you take think. up positions around the old rock crushing plant. They'll wait until they see Nephi, and then they'll start shooting. Nephi, got At it. At that point, just keep your head down and stay out of range of his golf club. We'll take care of the rest. All right. Get your rifles and move out first, Recon. We've got a fiend to Okay, so, um... Oh, they're off. I probably should change before I... Usual typical thing, me to forget that. Right, where are we going, then? We'll... Samson Rock Crushing Plant. What we gotta do is we've gotta we gotta go here. Cassidy Caravan's wreckage. Is this gonna be easier for us to just go all the way up this road? Rather than through Ah, we're going through fiend territory anyway, because I want to kill some fiends with my rangefinder. Sounds like we're running prim now. I'd still run. Okay, what's that building? Have we been in there? Yeah, yeah. Alright, I found one. What I'm looking for is more than one. I really want to test this weapon out. And of course, killing one person with it is probably going to be... Oh, okay. How old is this? I'm running around trying to find a large enough group of fiends to have fun with. Oh, okay. What the hell? Oh, of course, of course. I really have got to check this. I keep forgetting I've got that. Uh, uh. Okay. Um, I will take the rifle from you. Thank you very much. There's one over there and one over there. Actually, let's keep our eyes open. Twenty gauge sawn off stock. Now I can actually get mods for the um, for the three shooter. Actually, two mods, which is kind of cool. West pump station, and there are probably I, just, I can't go in there and kill fiends because of course they're. Oh, hello. Damn it! Yeah, I keep forgetting. I can't use this inside. Okay. 
I see a single fiend over the bridge. Oh, I see two. Now, where are we meeting them? Just about there. Over there somewhere, isn't it? Yep. So, one fiend, two fiend. Not enough. Don't know why I keep going for headshots. This weapon. I'm going to kill them if I shoot them. In the chest as well. Oh! If I hit, of course. Alcohol whiskey has worn off. All right. Oh! Okay, Eileen. Um, yeah, we were looking for you. Oh God, that was <coughs> slightly random, wasn't it? Am I? Oh, I'm thirsty. I am thirsty. Yeah, I completely forgot there was another one. How are we doing? Nutrition nine. That's not where Nephi's going to be found, is it? Battle rifle. We'll check that out. That could be. Thanks, the emasculator, Eileen's finger. Okay. We had... Thanks. Violet. You were right about applying the fire. I used your method and it worked like a charm. The NCR punk cried like a bitch from the start and I had to cut out the tongue to keep the noise down. Later, I burnt his feet until he couldn't feel it, then cut off the cooked parts. I started over on the unburned flesh and it was like having a fresh captive again. The bastard squirmed so much I had to use another strap to keep him under control. After I got his knees, I cut off his eyelids and let him... Sit under the sun for a cut. This person really, I don't really think I need to read any more of this. You said some guy from the from way east taught you right. What was his name? Marco? I can't remember. He must be a bad you-know-what. All right. Now, we've already killed Violet, and for that, I am um, pretty damned glad. You know what? Let's just completely make sure. I mean, if we had a stake and hammer, I'd be using it about now. All right. Okay, we've got other fiends. Are they the ones I'm looking for? I think they are. And that is my backup. <laughs> okay, let's find a large group of them. We don't want to kill the head guy. I want to make sure you guys stay, be passive. Alright, I'm looking for somebody. There's, you know what? Follow me, girls. I think what we should do 
is get you guys set up over here. Oh, can I see more of them? I think I can see more of them. You guys can stay here next to our man. Okay, Sam, Samson Rock. Crush it. All right, almost check in there. All right. Are those... All right. Now, I want you to... Uh, no, I want you to be aggressive. Now we're talking. But... Nope, I want, you to, I want you to wait here. Right, I'm looking... For the lieutenant. Not... The lieutenant, not the lieutenant. Are we up? Oh, there's the lieutenant. All right. See if he is ready for me to cause a little bit of m mayhem. Sergeant Schlitz. Okay, I'll. Take him. We're all set up. You just lornify close. Okay, right, so they're actually ready. They're just waiting on me. Alright. Um <laughs> I am so looking forward to seeing this. I have never seen this weapon in action. I suppose I'm not. Yeah, I'm not supposed to kill Nephi. Can we identify which one is Nephi? Over here. What? No, no, no. stop. Who you should? Don't. No, 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 no. You know what I could do with? I could do with. All right. You know what? We're just, we're only here for a test anyway. Let's. Okay. Okay, that's very cool. <laughs> okay. I think he's dead. <laughs> There's Nefi. <laughs> oh, God. Just don't shoot Nefi. Come on, dude. Hello. You coming? <laughs> I got some friends who want to meet you. Ah. Uh, oh, dear. Here you go, guys. It's Christmas. You're welcome. Oh, don't shoot him in the head. Don't shoot him in the head. Nice. Gems. Golf driver. We'll take it. Nephi's head. Awesome. Oh dear. Alright girls, you Sounds can like follow. Let's chat to the lieutenant. Let's see. Heading on home? Okay. Okay, that was pretty easy with these guys. But you came through for us. I have to admit, I wasn't sure you'd make it. Means a lot, <laughs> letting my team get payback. I had Here. some firepower help. We all pitched in some caps for you. Even Sterling. And he's famous for his tight wallet. All right. That's 300. That'll do. Tell me about the first recon. We're the finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. If you need a bullet put into a target's eye from 800 yards away, you call us. Okay. Some of my team aren't without their share of scars, though. Like Betsy and Sterling. Uh, what's wrong with Betsy? I like Betsy. Cook Cook, one of the fiends, ambushed her in ten of spades. They both managed to escape, but not before Cook Cook raped her. Okay. Betsy shrugged it off like it was nothing, but her behavior keeps getting worse. Always making passes at every woman who wanders by. It's inappropriate for anyone at first recon to behave that way. I could discipline her, but I'd rather she get medical help. Okay. Uh, I'll talk to her about it. I like Betsy. I now have another reason to kill Cook Cook. I'd appreciate it. As her CO, I could order her to get help, but I'd have her agree with the idea. All right, I'll chat to her. What happened to Sterling? Corporal Sterling was an NCR ranger until he was captured by the Legion. They tortured him pretty badly. He wasn't able to be a ranger after that, but his eyes are still sharp, so I had him transferred to first recon. All right. Tell me about... No, I've already done that one. Does the NCR usually offer bounties on people? If they've proven hard to kill, yes. 
Whatever it takes to get the job done, even if it means hiring help from outside the military. Okay. Right, so I gotta, Gar I gotta, I gotta Whoa. seek. What? 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 Okay. Where was Betsy? Ten of spades. Is that Betsy? Yes, hey Betsy! You did good out there. Glad you let me get a piece of Nephi. You're welcome. You should get medical help for your trauma. That's really subtle, isn't it? The lieutenant's been talking to you, hasn't he? Yep. Look, I don't need a head doctor. I'm first recon, damn it. Okay. You don't see the others crying about every little bruise and scrape, do you? Uh, medicine. Oh, God, I'm awesome at this. Of course I am. Mental trauma can slow you down and distract you, but it's treatable, just like any bullet wound. God, I sound clever. Just another injury to take care of, huh? Well, when you put it that way. All right. You can tell the lieutenant I finally caved. All right. There's a Dr. Usanagi who's supposed to be good at this sort of thing. Brilliant. That was easy. Yeah. Try not to get killed. Yeah, yeah. She's just full of great advice. Lieutenant. What can I do for you? She's gonna... There you go. I've convinced Corporal Betsy to get help from Dr. Usanagi. I wish someone Saganagi. with your medical training had come along sooner. I know. I think she'll actually stick with the treatment because of what she said. I know, I'm just I was afraid that awesome. Betsy wouldn't go for long-term treatment because she didn't want to look bad in front of the rest of the squad. You settled that. Do me a favor and let Usanagi know Corporal Betsy is coming. I'd like to make sure the medical clinic has time for her. All right, fine. Gary. Oh, bodies, 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 bodies. Right. Where were they? Loot. Um, we got a live one here. He doesn't look very healthy, though, does he? He's walking a little funny. How many shots did that need? Let me do the shooting next time if they're that far away. Microfusion cells do not grow on trees. Okay, did I loot you? Well, you were actually in the fire, weren't you? Yes, I believe I looted you. The lack of a head is the giveaway. Cowboy repeater. All right, well, I've tested. <laughs> I have tested out my um my new toy. <laughs> that is pretty damned awesome. I'm guessing it'll kill just about anything. That it, uh, that it hit. It's, you know what? It, there's no guarantee I've actually killed everything here, is there? I believe I can only use it once per day. Which kind of makes sense. Not worth it. I could probably use it to repair another item, though. True. Varmint rifle. Nah, you know what? So it's Cook Cook next. That's the next bounty. All right. Was there anything else in here? My God. I mean, they actually lived here. Really were high on chems, weren't they? Any... Nothing, not even a bed, not even a... I've been over there. I believe I've been over there. Yep, Poseidon Ranger Station. At Vault 22. I actually believe that's on the other side. Yeah, there's mountains there. Right, I have to get to that from here. Hmm. Okay, I think we've got everything. Oh, I lied. Ignore me. Ooh. Super stim packs. Might as well take everything. Dirty one. Yep, still need those for certain recipes, so why not? And, okay, that's it. Let's go back and talk to 
the major and get a reward and then agree to kill Cook Cook. Because I quite like the idea of killing Cook Cook. Door to Hank's transmissions. Actually, there's a building over there I was thinking of trying. All right, girls. Sitting tight. Read. Did I tell you to be aggressive? Slim nope. Pickings. Be aggressive. With a smile. Okay. Hank's transmissions. Interesting. There should be a knock on. Holy. Mmm. I'm assuming Hank was hostile. He looked hostile. He didn't actually attack, did he? I... Okay. Um. Um. If you were not actually feral, Hank, I owe you an apology. You you did look it though, mate. Activate workbench. Right. Stories. Fixing things. Uh, no. Empty. Nothing really jumping out as fishing battery as super useful to it. Duct tape! Egg timer. I don't think I've actually got many of those, and they can be useful for certain things. Filing cabinet and a lathe of some type. Oh, you know what I'm not doing? I'm not checking for mines, which. Alright. Cupid's capers. Sounds rude. Whiskey! Which I keep forgetting to take. I need to take more of that. Which is an odd thing to hear myself say, but there you go. Not that I don't like whiskey, but... <laughs> when you say you should take something because it's good for you, whiskey doesn't immediately spring to mind. Rich V300. Yes. Password is... Mental! Worrying. Come on. Bilo computers, log in. Hank's transmission. Computer ready. Jack Bryan's bill. Mr. Bryan's, your car will be done this Tuesday around noon, so come on down, just call first. Your warranty did cover most of the bill, but they do not have... They do have a deductible of $250. Thanks for your business. Hank Hill, Hank's Transmissions, will get you going again. All right. So Hank was a car repair person-y type thing. Okay. Do we have... See, I, there's so much junk here. I'm completely convinced I'm going to miss the one thing that's truly staggeringly important about this place. And more importantly, I'm worried that it's staring me right in the face and I just haven't noticed it. And I'm causing lots of blunt force trauma to many foreheads right now. It is a worry. It is something I have to consider. Um, okay. What have we got in here? Medical clipboard. Anything underneath? Vodka, Nuka Cola, Sunset Sarsaparilla, got it. Hot plate, I, do I have a hot plate? I do now. Food stash. I actually need some food for a certain quest and I can never remember which it is and whether I've picked enough of it up. Duct tape. Have I mentioned my... Uh, Absolute love of duct tape. I believe I must have. I think, honestly, this place doesn't really have much in the way of um, loot. Okay, wait, what? Picture frame! All right. Oh, God, I almost missed duct tape. Oh, my God, I really did, didn't I? Oh, my God. Handbrake, got it. All right. Well, if I missed anything else. <laughs> um, before we head back to the major, I am curious as to what the hell that stone was. It stone crushing place was. We can we. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I did forget, didn't I? There yeah, they're coming. 
I'm just going to tell them to wait for me when I get out here as well. Okay. I am once more going... You really do run faster than Veronica. Is that the armor? It probably is, isn't it? Sitting tight. Here and we pretty. go. Oh. Your in the um. Ladies. It's, um. Come over here. Let's hit the road. Staying Staying low. You're going to need a little bit of distance between you and what is about to come through that door after I come through the door. Okay, so. Sitting tight. Stay here and. No, no, no. Wrong. Now we're talking. Be very aggressive. Okay, so. I'm going to have to hit this thing with something that pierces its scaly hide. Oh. And seeing as I can't see a damned thing. Whiskey! Whiskey! Yes, whiskey and cat eye. Now it is dark, so hopefully it can't see me. Oh, I'm near the light. How many have we got? Oh, God, oh God, oh God, stay away. God, I feel so exposed. I've got cat eye and I'm in the dark. Whoa. That was kind of terrifying. Oh my God. All right, you know what? I'm running. Kill it, kill it. Okay, I'm alive. I'm. Oh God, it's bright. I am alive. Okay, a little bit of damage on one arm, but all right. Now I've got to remember to. Uh, my God, it is in fact exceptionally bright. No, wrong. Yeah. Yeah, ain't that a kick in the head? Where are you? Thank you. Right, um, we've got quite a few things here, but before we get all excitable, All right, let's get excited. What the hell were death claws doing living in here? Seriously, how the hell did they get in? I actually don't think I need the cat eye is good enough, isn't it? What, did they come in when they were small or something? All right. So what was this place? It was a... a Samson office block, we're in. Ooh, hello. Foot locker. Desk. Okay, so last safe, let's... Oh, yeah, last safe, let's hope. It's not very hard. Easy. Nice. I'll take it all. Okay. Well... Not only did we get a tiny bit of loot, we also, okay, cleared the place of death claws. And that's always a good thing, really. Doing my good deed for the day. Oh, God, it's bright. Okay, um. Oh, God, that really is offensively bright, isn't it? Right, let's get the whiskey's worn off. Can't the cat eye? Let's go see... The Major and get our reward for killing Nephi and uh, I then I guess we should go and Am I going the right direction? We should go and uh, case out the Van Graffs for Cass. Am I heading in the wrong direction? This is probably exactly what I'm doing. What is this? Oh I was here before shooting people, yes. 
What a... Oh. Nope. Follow me. Um. West pump station. Okay, I'm not supposed to go in there. Maybe I shouldn't. Is that NCR owned? Oh, thank God for that. Right, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to guess those two will catch us up. Let's go and see the major now. Okay. Is that him? Hey. Yes, it is. Got any more good news for me? I do. I have a nice ripe head for you. You killed another one. Oh, yeah. Let me have a look at the head. Well, actually, the, the snipers did. Well, well, yeah. well. Driver Nafai. Nothing to say, you son of a bitch. No tips on my golf swing. Lost a lot of good men to this psychopath. Morale's gonna be better now that he's gone. Here's the bounty I promised. I guess How we much? can send first recon down to Camp Forlorn Hope. They need all the help they can get there. Okay, yeah, yeah, I remember That's that place. Two psychopaths dead. Yeah, if sure you can bring down the third, it. there's a bonus in it for you. Excellent. I will go after Cook Cook. One thing I should tell you about Cook Cook: piece of shit is pure animal. But we're going to do it later. One of my snipers, and that makes this personal. We have vengeance also, to perform. He's got a flamethrower, and he's damn good with it. All right. From what I hear, Don't he get either close. rapes or burns every living thing he gets his hands on. Okay. Only one man's gotten close to killing him, and that's little Buster. So he says, anyway. Maybe it's bullshit, but I'd still ask him about it. All right. Ask little Buster. Who is little Buster? Bounty hunter. Talks big. But he's still alive, so he can't be completely full of is shit. Is that a guy punching? I think he's out in the yard waiting to yeah, claim a couple bounds. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Thank you very much. You've gone after the fiends before. I don't have to tell you to keep alert. Good luck. Just one alert? Can I keep many alerts? <laughs> I know. Terrible. Right. <laughs> okay. Right, let's find... Yeah, it's the guy that's the punching the, the, uh, the training dummy over there, I think. Go and talk to him. Find out what he knows about Cook Cook. Let me guess. You got work for me, right? Nope. Well, you're too late. I just quit the bounty trade. Don't as soon as care. I pick up some caps that Dautry owes me, I'm out of this scrapyard. Okay. Major Dautry said I should ask you about Cook Cook. The rapist with the flamethrower? That's the one. Yeah, that's a combination I stay the fuck away from. Uh, I was stalking him for a while. There's money in it. Real good at that. Watching people from where they can't see me, you know? Only in one thing I armor. learned about that asshole. Keeps a bunch of Brahmins. Most of them he roasts whenever he feels like it. But there's one. Must be his pet or some shit. Doesn't let anybody near that Brahmin. Somebody puts a bullet in her? I bet that piss him off good. Might make him careless, too. Okay, shoot his cow. Okay. Hey. Don't want to talk to that silly looking person. Right, anyway, yes, yeah, so we, we're gonna kill Cook Cook, but before we do that, we did promise Gas that we would visit vengeance upon the Bungrafs. But first, I guess I've got to wait for a little while for the girls to catch up. Really? Oh, ladies, come on, where the hell are you? Hey. <sighs> Run! Oh, okay. <sighs> oh, brilliant. Head injury. Of course, that's that's exactly what I needed. A head injury. <sighs> How did I get a head injury? Were there any more mines? Why are there mines here, anyway? Did I trip? I th thought I saw an extra one. Oh, maybe I did. I'm not seeing it now. Okay, seriously, they're not. They've not moved. Come on. Let's roll out then. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, we're gonna go back. Pick up the car. And go see the van. Oh, fuck! Yippee! Yeah.